Plays like this get me absolutely hyped for this coming fantasy football season, especially since they are being made by guys like Jahan Dotson, who is one of my favorite fantasy football sleepers this coming season. And this isn't new for me. This is a guy that I've liked for over a year now. Loved him as a prospect coming out of Penn State. 2021 was Jahan Dotson's final season at Penn State. And in that season, he ranked number 12 in receptions with 91, number 18 in receiving yards with 1,182. And he tied for number eight in receiving touchdowns with 12 for college football, which landed him first round draft capital from Washington at pick 16 overall last season. Rookie season last year for Jahan Dotson, he averaged 10.9 fantasy points per game, but he only played in 12 games. He was a bit banged up. If we look at the games, he played 70% plus of the snaps. He actually averaged 14.03 fantasy points per game. That mark across a full season in points per game would nearly be a top 20 wide receiver. 523 receiving yards and seven touchdowns in those 12. Credit Matt Harmon receptionperception.com go check it out if you look at the success by route last season for Jahan Dotson a lot of green there which is a good thing another question mark we have for Jahan Dotson is what does that connection look like with Sam Howell how does Sam Howell look for this coming year we are already seeing an established connection between these two in training camp with Sam Howell boosting Jahan Dotson. He's quoted saying, he's so polished, man. He's such a good wide receiver. I was a huge fan of his when he was in college, and I'm excited to play with him. This means something. So when making any case for a wide receiver to have a good year or to deem somebody a sleeper, we have to check some boxes. So here are some boxes that I have checked for Jahan Dotson. Quality prospect. 4-4-3 speed, catch and run ability. He had a good volume profile at Penn State. Zone beater, great hands. First round draft capital. Number two, he had very good games as a rookie. Again, look at those games that he played 70% plus of the snaps. The touchdowns did help, but he was scoring fantasy points last year. Number three, establishing a connection with his brand new quarterback. These guys are making plays in preseason practice, in preseason games. His quarterback is hyping him up. That's a good thing. Which leads me to my next point. He just has the opportunity for a big role. He has the opportunity for volume, which is something we love for fantasy football when it comes to wide receivers. Add this all up. Love the talent. Love the opportunity. Jahan Dotson is a true sleeper that can be great for fantasy football in 2023. Right now, he's going off the board as the wide receiver 37.